Hello, this is Johnny Wilcox from Prog Sheet, and this is six wonderful songs from the band Barkley James Harvest. Uh, now, uh, sort of a preamble here, Barkley James Harvest is a band I've been listening to since, I think, the ninth grade. Uh, my art teacher, Miss Almond, had gone to England over the summer months and brought back the double live album Barkley James Harvest Live and at that time she used to play records in class as we were doing art and I heard this stuff and I was like oh I like this and so after that I started following the band so that was you know 74 yeah 74 into 75 and I've been following them to this day um, we're going to start with a song Galadriel off of their that's off the once again once again album their second album um beautiful song obviously inspired by the character from the lord of the rings a nice john lee's composition i used to play this song out in coffee houses in the 80s uh, it was always a nice one to play a uh, nice melody great vocal just a serene beautiful piece so that's where we're starting, Galadriel. Uh, song number two from their first album is a song called Mother Dear, um, which I believe is a Willie Wollstone home vocal, who was their, mostly their keyboardist, great, great singer though, and uh, features uh, some orchestral stuff from, I believe, uh, Robert John Godfrey, who later went on to form the, the wonderful band, the Enid. Uh, but Mother Dear, uh, it's funny, it's, it's ballady, but it has a, a dark element to it. Really interesting, interesting piece. So, so that's song number two, Mother Dear. Song number three is Song With No Meaning from um, Barclay James Harvest and other short stories. A uh, nice song by Les Holroyd, beautiful vocal, incredible, rich, relaxing harmonies. That's just a beautiful song. Oddly enough, my mom used to love this song. She would always love to hear it. So that is Song With No Meaning, and that's song number three. Song number four uh, is another song I used to play out uh, called Ursula, subtitled The Swan Sea Song. Uh, a simple little love song with some nice keyboards, lots and lots of acoustic guitar, very folky, very melodic. A brief number, but a great number. Um, and this is a good time to remind to look below in the comments section. I have put links to all the songs, all six songs. So that was Ursula, the Swan Sea song is number four. Number five, quite possibly my favorite Barclay James Harvest song, a song called One Night, off of their uh, wonderful album, Time Honored Ghosts, um, another John Lee's song. I talked with him about this years ago. We did an interview. I forget for who, but it was back in the 80s, and um, I was going to go play this song that very night at... Um, can't think of the name of, of the uh, coffee house, but I used to go there all the time. It'll probably come back to me after I finish this video. But uh, he was like, oh, that's a good one. He's was, he was quite pleased with this particular song, which I believe is about a prostitute, of all things. Um, give a listen. You'll notice verse to verse to verse, each one is more elaborate in terms of harmonies. It's very, very well done to have the song as it progresses build and build in different ways and, and just adding level after level. Beautifully done, beautiful song. Uh, One Night, that's song number five. And finish with a very moody, less Holroyd song off of the Baby James Harvest album called 100,000 Smiles Out. Um, about a guy out in space, and not unlike Major Tom in Space Oddity, but um, 
I, I sense some kind of unhappy paranoia within it, maybe. Maybe I'm just reading that into the lyric. Terrifyingly good guitar taking you out of the song. Uh, long, long outro. Really nice vocal. Um, really eerie, eerie song, I suppose is what I'd say. And uh, that's 100,000 Smiles Out. And that takes us to the end of our six wonderful Barclay James Harvest songs. Um, I do hope you'll give a listen. An overlooked band, uh, one of my favorite bands of all time. Never get tired of listening to them, never will. I hope you find something within these that you'll enjoy as much as I do. Take care, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.